Hey guys, today me and Andrew are going to be trying some pork rinds, or pork clouds as these are called, um, fried pork skins. Uh, Berkshire Bacon Lovers sent these to us, so thank you very much for sending these to us. Um, I have the Malabar Black Pepper, Jalapeno Pepper, and you have... Try again. Habanero. Habanero. That's hotter. <laughs> what did and I say? Jalapeno. Did I say jalapeno? Yeah. Well, I translated that wrong in my head, didn't I? <laughs> Rosemary and sea salt. Well, let's try those last. I didn't mean to be. No, I'm glad you corrected me because I, I I didn't even realize I'd said it wrong. 70, 70, and 70. 70. So they're all the same. Half I'm thinking try this one first. Yeah, they're all the black pepper. Black pepper? Uh, no, let's try the sea salt. Rosemary and sea salt. Rosemary. And they say all kinds of stuff on the front of them. Join us for the pork revolution. Craft brew munch. Yeah, I mean, most Delve of us now delve dip. into chip. I can't imagine dipping these in chip. They dip. Chop for a mess. Mm. Power to the pork. I do like the pork. Now, are these fat ones are, oh yeah, these are puffy ones. Mm hmm. Big, fat, fluffy pork rinds. Mm. They're good and tender, too. Mm hmm. I'm trying earnestly to find the flavor. That's not pork rind. You mean beyond just pork rind? Mm -hmm. It tastes like, yeah, I get a little bit of the rosemary flavor. It's just a, a yeah. Kind of reminds you of garlic a little bit. That's pretty light flavor. It's more just a pork rind. Yeah. I had to eat a huge one. Yeah. But I did get some salt. And that rosemary's. Yeah. Those awesome. are really good. Those are good. Those are really good. And they don't dry your mouth out like like some of the pork rinds I've had before. The really cheap pork rinds will dry you. Yeah, out. The, the little cheap ones are. All right, this is Malabar black pepper. There's an old myth that pork rinds hmm. make you sleepwalk. Oh really? I wonder if there's any truth to that. I can see pepper on this. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that thing. Hmm? That thing. It looks like a chicken. It did look like a chicken. This is a pork rind seasoned with pepper. And it's fantastic. Mm. Hot sauce. I'm getting a really good black pepper flavor. So. Now that one's drying my mouth out a little bit. This is my new favorite pork rind. Maybe. Oh, you like those with the pepper? That's really good. That thing is you can't find them right here. Nope. But it's okay. Because I will enjoy this bag and then I will move on <laughs> with my life. No need. Bacon there. Atlanta, Georgia. Pork skins, olive oil, black pepper, and salt. That's it. That's good. Yeah, this. I want to keep going, so we better just yeah set that down and go Jack for that. over the habanero. Hmm. I thought it might smell hot, so I smelled it. <laughs> smell the heat. That had a little odd flavor right off the top. I think it's that pepper flavor. Oh, my. You shove half a bag in your mouth. Ooh, one. <laughs> Just a big one. No, that's pretty good. Well, it's filleted. Yeah. Um, I hate to say it's the same. It's, it's going back to the first one for me. Mm -hmm. There's a little spice, little bitty spice. There is. It, it you can taste just a little bit of that pepper flavor, and that's about it. Mm -hmm. I, I guess I have a peppery pepper. type flavor to it. It is different. It's not hot though. It's not hot though at all. But no. the black pepper is awesome. The black pepper is my favorite one. Oh yeah, that, that it's fantastic. You know These what? are all three good though. Now I've swallowed. And I'm sitting here. I can I can get just a touch of hint. That's why. Yeah, that, that's what I was talking about. I mean, just the, it's it's barely there. It's um, a little bit. Really good though, very good quality, um, really good and tender. The texture and the flavor is excellent. Um, I don't, like I said, the, the black pepper one's probably my favorite one. I think it was yours too. Wasn't yeah, it? It, absolutely. Um, and then the sea salt probably my third, my second, but whatever. Um, so thank you again for sending this to us. We really appreciate it. And uh, if you like this video, please leave us a like. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And we'll catch you next time.